let's look at Choropleth maps. Choropleth maps display divided geographical areas or regions that are coloured, shaded or patterned in relation to a data variable. This provides a way to visualise values over geographical areas which can show variation or patterns across the displayed location. The data variable uses colour progression to represent itself in each region of the map. Typically, this can be a blending from one colour to another, a single hue progression, transparent to opaque, light to dark, or an entire colour spectrum. The downside to the use of colour is that you can't accurately read or compare values from the map. Another issue is that larger regions appear more emphasised than smaller ones, so the viewer's perception of a shaded value are affected. A common error when producing choropleth maps is to encode raw data values such as population rather than using normalised values, for example calculating population per square kilometre, to produce a density map. To find out more information on this chart, such as tools you can use to generate it, follow the link below in the description.